Your vehicle is equipped with a push-button ignition. To start the engine, the shift selector must be in park and the brake pedal depressed. Now, push the ignition switch. To stop the engine, move the shift selector to the park position and push the ignition switch to the off position. When the ignition switch is pushed without depressing the brake pedal, the ignition switch will illuminate and the vehicle is in the ACC mode. Push the ignition switch a second time to change to on and a third time to return to off. If the ignition is left in the ACC position, various systems in the vehicle can drain the battery and your vehicle may not start. As a precaution, if the driver's door is opened while the ignition switch is in the ACC or on position, a chime will sound. Also, a chime will sound if the ignition is in the off or lock position with the intelligent key left in your vehicle. To turn your engine off, put the shift selector in park and push the ignition switch to turn off the vehicle. The ignition switch will default to lock when any door is opened or closed after the engine is turned off. If the battery of the intelligent key is almost discharged, the guide light for the intelligent key port located on the lower left of the steering column will blink and the indicator on the vehicle information display will appear. In this case, inserting the intelligent key into the port allows you to start the engine. Make sure the intelligent key is placed in the correct direction. The front side faces upward and the key ring side faces the driver. To remove it, push the ignition switch to the off position and pull the intelligent key out. The intelligent key port does not charge the intelligent key battery. If you see the low battery indicator in the vehicle information display, replace the battery as soon as possible.